welcome to the Science Experience at Macquarie University 2015. During the science experience, we got hands-on with experiments and activities that were both challenging and exciting. In the paleontology practical, we studied how the footprints left by extinct animals can give us an exciting in insight into their activities and behaviours. My name is Marissa Betts. I'm a PhD student at Macquarie University in paleontology. And today we're running our dinosaur trackways prac. So Toby, what are you doing? Uh, I'm measuring the stride length of the footprints. And Beth, why are we doing this? Um, we're doing this to measure his speed and a variety of other things and then we can compare them to some dinosaur measurements that we have got from upstairs. In the chiropractic lesson we experienced chiropractic action and found out what chiropractic science is all about. We learned from the current students how chiropractors go about diagnosing, treating and preventing disorders of the musculoskeletal system. Could you tell me a little bit about um, what we're doing here today. <laughs> um, so my name is Ash and I'm a final year chiropractic student in the Masters of Chiropractic here at Macquarie and so what we're doing is we're just teaching the students a little bit more about chiropractic and what we do, like what we're doing with you on the balance board. <laughs> the hands-on chemistry activity was lots of fun and we performed a series of experiments. My name's Marie Nelson. I run first year chemistry at Macquarie Uni. We're in the chemistry lab at the moment doing dry ice experiments. Uh, what are you doing here? Um, we're doing an experiment about heat exchange. For the physics activity, we learnt about exoplanets and saw how astronomers actually detect them in practice. So today the students are playing with a series of telescope images. And what they're doing is they're trying to hunt for an exoplanet. The technique is known as the transit method. So Jade, could you just tell me a little bit more about what you're doing here? Sure. Um, I'm an Aboriginal student, I'm studying a Bachelor of Science with a Diploma of Education, so I intend on being a high school science teacher. I'm employed as an Indigenous cadet with the NICET program, so my involvement with that, along with doing the science shows, is also to act as a kind of mentor for um, the students in our partner schools. In the robotics activity, we learnt about robots and how they use sensors to accomplish their tasks, and we also programmed our own robots to complete a maze. So tell me a little bit more about what's happening here today. So today we're looking at using the EB3 kits, which, which are a LEGO uh, robotics kit uh, provided by LEGO. The planetarium was lots of fun. We observed the apparent movement of the stars due to the spin of the Earth and our movement around the Sun, travel through space and see amazing astronomy movies. Could you tell us a little bit more about the planetarium? Um, the planetarium is pretty cool. It just projects the sky in, um, onto the dome. It can basically travel through space and time and see the planets and some deep sky objects. In the biology practical, we learnt some of the techniques used to identify species based on unique patterns in hair samples. So would you like to tell us um, what we're doing today? We're trying to identify three different types of hair. We've been given uh, hair from a dog, hair from a possum and hair from a wallaby. We're using PVA glue and we put the hair inside the PVA and then wait for it to dry and then you take the hair out and it should leave a scale which you can then look at under the microscope and see it. I hope you enjoyed the 2015 science experience at Macquarie University as much as we did. And we hope to see you here next year for the 2016 Science Experience. So goodbye for now and remember, Science, science is awesome! It's programs like Macquarie Science Experience that help our students evolve.